and welcome back to my channel. Today I have a super easy DIY using Dollar Tree products and it's my first collab here on my channel. So let's get started. So today's video is in collab with Gigi from Thoughtful Savvy Mom. She will also be sharing a really cute DIY for a bowl holder. And she also does very motivational cleaning videos. You need to check her out. Make sure you stop by her channel right after this video so that you can get some more ideas. And if you came over from Gigi's channel, welcome. Make sure you subscribe so that you don't miss out on any other videos. And let's get started. So for the first bowl holder that we will be making, we will need a hula hoop. This one is the smallest one they have. They have different sizes. Make sure you pick the smallest one. You will also need some diamond wrap. You can also use any kind of ribbon that you want, but I decided to go with this style. They have different colors as well. So if you don't like the design on the hula hoop, you can just spray paint it. I decided to keep the design because it's the unicorns. It looks pretty magical and perfect with this diamond wrap. So I'm just going to measure three strips that are going to go uh, one in the middle and two on the sides. And I'm just going to go ahead and hot glue them on each end. So after gluing that, this is the finished look. I am going to add a little ribbon at the top so that I can hang it. You can use whatever you like, but I think this is a little small touch that will make it really cute and easy to hang. So I'm going to take this piece of ribbon and I'm going to add it to the middle at the very top where I'm going to hang this. And I'll be using this command hook. I have these tiny ones that are perfect for decorations. Um, it's clear, it's small, and it's perfect for this. So I'm going to go ahead and add it to the wall and just hang this up and start adding my bows. I love how it turned out. I think it was so easy and affordable to make. Such a great idea for a decoration as well. And now for the second DIY, I'm going to be using this bag tag. You can also find this at the Dollar Tree. They have different designs and I'll be using some ribbon. I got this ribbon at Hobby Lobby. It was just 99 cents. Sometimes it's on sale. Also this other ribbon from Hobby Lobby. You can pick whatever design you like. And I decided to go with a thicker ribbon for this one. So I'm just going to turn it to the back and I'm going to add some hot glue and I'm just going to add the ribbon on there. And towards the end, I'm just going to add a little bit of sparkle with this ribbon so that it gives it a little bit more of a finished look. Also guys, don't forget that at the end of the video, you can leave me a comment down below so that you can let me know which one was your favorite of these three DIYs. And if you guys want to follow me on Instagram, I'll leave you my handle here. I share a lot of ideas and some upcoming videos, so make sure you follow me. So this is how it turned out. I think it's super cute and just so easy to make. I love the rainbow at the top and you can also remove the hook at the very top, the plastic, so that it has a different look. And for this last DIY, I'm going to be using this paper towel holder. And this is perfect to store all your scrunchies. I never thought these would be in style again. They are super cute and perfect if you don't want that hair tie dent in your hair. And you can also use them to store all your hair clips. And this is super easy for your kids to have everything organized and such a cute display. Also guys, I have a bunch of videos where I do so many easy DIYs with Dollar Tree products. Super affordable and cute. So I'll have a list of all the videos in the description box below. 
Well guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to like and subscribe so that you don't miss out on any other videos. And don't forget to stop by Gigi's channel to check out her video and get more ideas. I'll have the link in the description box below. As always, thanks for watching and I'll catch you in my next video. Bye!